Hello everyone and welcome to What Goes Around Comes Around's Bag Brunch. It is Sunday, a beautiful day here in New York City. So sunny. I think it's just hitting above 80 degrees after that crazy kind of weather we had coming from Canada. So I hope that everyone up in Canada is safe and especially here in New York City that everyone is safe as well and throughout the country where everyone is affected. But we're excited to be here today. I hope you have your mimosas, you have your brunch in front of you. I, of course, am going to do a delicious La Pananarie. Look at this sandwich. Oh my God, this is so delicious. On a baguette, it is roasted red peppers, tomatoes, roasted red peppers, I think, or tomatoes. Anyways, it doesn't matter. Arugula, mozzarella, prosciutto, and a little truffle sauce. It was really hard, because let me tell you, the option that they gave me on Grubhub as well was, would you like to add some Prosecco to this? Uh, yeah, I would, but I can't because I'm working. But I just want you to know, I am there with you guys having a little bit of a mimosa. So, please enjoy your brunch. Of course, keep your bags far from it. We don't want to ruin our bags while eating the brunch. And let's get into our very first bag of the today because this is all about what? Clutches anytime. It is summertime, so that means galas, weddings, events, anything and more. So the clutches are where we need to go. Of course, I'm going to pull out my gloves because we're going to start with an Hermes piece. I don't feel like, like I often start with the Hermes pieces, so let's give them a little love. Why not? I feel like eventually I'm going to need music to put on these gloves. It's so much fun. I love it. I feel like we need to bring back the driving glove. We have Hermes gloves. Okay. We're going to start with this incredible piece. This is the Hermes. Blue Izmir Epsom GJ Alon 29. This is absolutely stunning. It's from 2016. Epsom leather, which I've talked about, it's basically a leather that is treated and has a layer over it that is stain resistant, water resistant, scratch resistant, extremely durable, very lightweight, which I love about it. And look at this color, Blue Izmir. Izmir is the beautiful city in Turkey, just off the coast and it is gorgeous. Gorgeous sea waters, this beautiful blue color. So that's what this was named after. Speaking of Turkey and our wonderful Turkish people, our wonderful moderator Michelle is here with us today. She is Turkish. Fantastic. Glad to have her with us. She'll be happy to answer any questions you may have. And when I bring out these amazing Zoom products, she'll put them over here on the left if this is your first time with us. And then, of course, over my shoulder. And then we have the chat box. So if you have any questions, anything you want to ask, don't hesitate. I'm here to answer all of them. Look at this stunning piece. I love this clutch. So the GJ actually has a fantastic history behind it because it is all about love. The GJ was originally came out into production in public in 1975 but it was created by Jean Gourand, who was the son-in-law of Hermes' CEO at the time, Emile Hermes, and he gave it to his daughter-in-law on the day of her wedding, created this clutch for her, so it's all about love and unity. They call it the GJ because J and G are basically his initials, Jean Gourand, but in the French alphabet, J is G and G is J, so GJ is how you would say it, or just G in the American pronunciation. Beautiful piece, look at this, virtually nowhere to it. And you're not gonna believe this, originally $4,500, but this is currently on promotion for a limited time only for only $3,150. Can you believe that incredible price? That is below retail at Hermes even. Only $3,150. I love this piece because there's no hardware. It's honestly just a very sleek piece. This. Well, their tab pool goes straight through the H there, which I love, a great way to use the heritage and bring in functionality. Beautiful. The vintage ones are normally lined in twall. This one is a newer model, like I said, 2016, and it has a lambskin lining, which I absolutely love that. Of course, we always still want to stuff the bags. It will come with one of our what goes around, comes around dust bags, full lambskin, all in the interior. And I love this here. This is how you can tell whether it was, if it had hardware, what it would be. Some of them feature gold, some of them feature silver or palladium hot stamping. This is technically a silver palladium hot stamping. 
So this would technically have had palladium hardware, which I do love. It kind of makes it a little bit more cooler, and you can really wear this year round. But this is the perfect bag for any event. I mean, you can dress this up, dress this down, because it is so versatile. One skin, originally $4,500. It is on promotion for only $3,150. Father's Day is coming up. I mean, I don't know if your father carries a clutch, it'd be great for him, but this would be the perfect bag to wear to whatever event you guys do with your father. So versatile, especially if it's a surprise, you don't know what it's gonna be. You could wear this if you guys do something nice, or if you do something casual, this is still a great bag for it. Once again, $4,500, but on promotion for only $3,150. absolutely stunning and thank you to everyone who's tuning in from facebook youtube and amazon we are currently live on amazon as well so thank you to everyone tuning in for any of our items that you don't see on our amazon shop or within this show just come over to what goes around nyc.com click on the flashing live button and all the products will be here as well and if you are on facebook and youtube please come over to us at what goes around nyc.com we'd be happy to have you Once again, $4,500 on promotion for only $3,150. The Gigi has a really special place in my heart because I really just like fell in love with it and my partner got it for me for my birthday one year, Vintage One, and it is absolutely stunning. It's actually from, I believe, 1976, so just the year after they were released. It's black, absolutely stunning. I'll bring it on the show one day. Okay, and don't forget, just take your dust bag, even though you don't really want it, it's a flat clutch, you don't really want to stretch it too much, easily just lay this flat in there so it just gives it a nice little bit, just there, a little bit of structure. And then for these bags, I always love, on Amazon, if you are on Amazon right now, it's easy, just look for a bag stand or a wallet stand, make sure there's enough width, that's how you just want to keep in your closet. I love when I can see my bags upright. Or just lay it flat. And I would always recommend laying it flat onto a velvet base. Beautiful. Once again, $4,500 originally on promotion for only $3,150. Okay. Let's move on to our next clutch for the show. Okay, and it's technically not a clutch, but you can wear it as a clutch. This is the Gucci Gigi Pink Bloom Supreme Canvas Dionysus Wallet on Chain, or as the handbag collecting community likes to call it, the Walk. So I love this piece because look, you have that Gigi Canvas, stands for Gucci O Gucci, created by Adolfo Gucci, and that Bloom's Print. So that Bloom's Print was first presented throughout the fall winter 2016 fashion show collection which was actually Alessandro Michel's first collection. He was the creative director who actually worked his way up through Gucci since the early 2000s. And he has made such a great name for himself. He recently left Gucci. We're excited to see what he does next. And, but basically, that print has now continued and he's evolved as an iconic Gucci print, similar to the floor print designed by one of the Gucci family members. And the floor print, you'd probably know it well. Jackie Kennedy oftentimes wore it. This is a great piece, so you can easily wear this as a clutch. You have that Dionysus symbol here with the dragon heads, basically how we know it's a Dionysus bag. Virtually no wear to this bag. There's no exterior wear, no corner wear, anything of such. Only $1,235. Absolutely incredible piece. And then, when you're tired of wearing it, when you're having fun at the event now, you can just easily pull out the crossbody chain. There you go, simple as that, and it is removable. So if you decide you don't wanna have the chain at all that night or give yourself that option, you can easily remove it. So it fits over your shoulder just like that, or easy as a crossbody. Once again, I am six foot five, it is hitting me just below my chest. So if you were below six feet, it's gonna hit you right at the hip or slightly below. So what a great piece to have. Very versatile, and that's what we love, especially when we're at these events. Sometimes we don't always want to hold the bag for too long. And look, it's even chic if you wrap the chain up around you and hold it. 
That's very runway, very like Chanel Gucci runway. That's what they would do. Incredible item. Absolutely love this. And by the way, the name Dionysus comes from the ancient Greek god. He was the Greek god of one of my other favorite things besides handbags, wine making. I love wine. And then, of course, orchards and fruit, vegetation, fertility, festivity, insanity, ritual madness, and religious ecstasy and theater. That's what he was the Greek god of. And that's what we love about Gucci. That's how you would describe Gucci and maybe some of the parties you go to. I don't know, but here you go. This would be the perfect bag for it. Absolutely elegant. And then I love that interior. We didn't talk about the interior, but look at that beautiful rose. Just, wow, I even know how to describe that color. Hermes has a color for that. And I can't even recall the name at this moment because it's just so beautiful. It's blinding. I love how just rich, dark pink it almost is. Then of course you have so many credit card pockets here, so you don't have to worry about a wallet being in here. iPhone Max does fit in here, without the case though, or a very thin case, very, very thin. You have two slots there as well. Another slot in the front with more credit card slots also, and then the zip here for your coins or any other valuables you want to put in there. Especially for events, it's really great if you are wearing any expensive jewelry and you need to take it off because you're afraid you wouldn't lose it throughout the night, put it in that zip pocket and you will be good to go. All right. And then of course, when storing the bag, always could recommend wrapping this up in paper or anything of the sorts and then just putting it in the bag and you're good to go. Or since it is removable, that's what I would actually recommend. Since it's removable, just take the chain off, keep it separately so it doesn't cause any kind of imprints into the bag. The reason I'm not taking it off is because I don't want to lose it amongst the fabulous other bags we have here. Once again, $1,235 for this incredible piece, practically store fresh. And look at that flora design, that blooms design. I apologize, not the flora. This is the blooms, but it's very similar. I like the blooms. It kind of makes it a little bit more modern. Flora, beautiful, but it is still just a piece that I would just need a little bit more, a little bit more color to, and that's what this Blooms gives us. Alessandro Michel did an amazing job with that. Okay, now let's get into a really fun collection. I'm glad we have one of these pieces. This is the Fendi, Fendi X Versace, but they call it Fendacci. I love that. This is the Fendacci black leather clutch with the wristlet strap. Look at that. Isn't that so cool? Fin Dachi. We have the FF for Fun Fur or Fun Fendi, created by Karl Lagerfeld. And then of course the Medusa by none other than Gianni Versace and now Donatella Versace, his sister who's taken over the house since his passing in the 90s. So I love it and I love what they decided to do. So basically Donatella Versace, Sylvia Venturi Fendi, and Kim Jones, who's the current creative director of Fendi, they decide it's not going to be a Fendi x Versace or Versace x Fendi collaboration. It's simply just Fendacci. And basically, don't you forget it as well. Because it's a swap rather than a collaboration. And most of all, it was done out of friendship. And that's what Kim Jones told Vogue, that that is how they decide to look at this. It's not just like a collab. It was, we're friends. Let's trade ideas. Let's have fun with this. And that's what fashion is all about. It's about fun. And I love it because you have basically that art, kind of the, the ancient Greek deco around it. But if you look closely, it's not just the ancient Greek kind of style, it's little FFs. So basically that Zuka, Zucchino kind of around there. Medusa head here. And I love Roma and Milano because they are ones from Rome, ones from Milan. And then of course you have, I love this hard look at that, a double FF and then you have the Medusa at the end. I tell you, they thought of everything they absolutely did. And I love you have the strap here. It can take off if you need to, but it's nice to have the wristlet option. Ooh, wait, let's listen to that again. Yes. I love the sound of a good quality zipper. And then of course you have this side here. Don't forget, always with the dust bags. And this one actually is, it will come with one of our what goes around comes around dust bags, but it does come with the Fendacci dust bag as well. 
to match the clutch perfectly. And then look at that interior. So much fun. You have that Fendachi logo again. You have eight credit card slots. And then of course, a slip pocket. So much room. Once again, your phones will fit in here. Everything you need for the day, for the evening will fit perfectly in here. You're not gonna believe the price on this. Only $1,050. This was released in 2022. They are not out anymore. We have not been able to see them. I'm sure you can still get them in certain for, uh, Fendi and Versace stores, but not online. So only on the pre-love market are you gonna find it. So much fun, $1,050 for this cool piece. I love it, kinda goes with my look today a little bit. I used to be obsessed with gold. I mean, my house used to look like, when I lived alone, it looked like Versailles threw up in it, and I was obsessed with it. But now, as I've kind of become more of a minimalist, kind of refined myself more, I'm loving silver, but every now and then, I'm like, ooh, I need the gold. I just need a little, need a little something in my life. That's why I can't live in Miami. I would just turn into the tackiest person in the world. But, you know, that wouldn't be such a bad thing, would it? Once again, $1,050 comes with the incredible dust bag. Matches perfectly. $1,050 for this beautiful piece. And then, of course, this is how I would recommend doing the dust bag with it if you are putting it away. And by the way, there's no wear to this piece. I don't know if I said that, but there is no wear on this item. When I'm putting it away, I would just put it in just like this. I would keep the leather wristlet part here on the front because you're gonna lay it down on its back. And you don't wanna lay it on its front even though it is not very heavy. You don't want any chance of a press mark. And then of course, I always talk about this like you're tucking it into bed. Both sides evenly. Tie it into a nice little bow. Just like that. And then you tuck in those bottom corners. Easily. Oh, come on. All right, I'm struggling a little bit, but usually I got this like down like a patch, but there you go. Now it's perfectly sealed just like that, and you can easily store it in your home. And honestly, tucking in the corners, all it does is just make it look really nice and really put together. Love this. Once again, $1,050 for this amazing piece. I don't even need to bring it back out of the dust bag. This is what it looks like. Perfect. There we go. Okay, on to our next item. Of course, you guys know I'm always going to have a little Murakami in our show. This piece, <laughs> I love it. It's just so precious, it's so small, so cute. This is the Louis Vuitton Takashi Murakami White Monogram Multicolore Wapiti Case. I love that name, Wapiti. So it's so small, but it's easy. It is removable here, so you can easily have this as your pouch. This always reminds me of Lizzo when she was on the red carpet, and she had that Jacumas, that little mini liquido bag, and it basically was like this big. So great. So that's what this reminds me of. You can have the littlest clutch. This is still so incredible. So obviously this piece is from 2005, but it was first introduced to Multicolor Collection in spring, summer 2023, or 2023, no, 2003, 20 years ago. And you won't believe this, there are 33 different colors in this tiny little Wapiti case here. Isn't that incredible? 33 different colors. And of course, you know what fits in here, you can put your lip balm in here, you put your AirPods in here, and then of course, a credit card or two. Your phone, unfortunately, you'll have to hold, but you're gonna wanna have your phone so you can record all those wonderful memories so it's not too bad. Beautiful piece. Then, of course, you have the wristlet here, which I love a wristlet on a clutch because, you know, throughout the night, it's easy. Once again, it fits on my hand just fine. It'll fit on yours. And you can easily just wear this around wherever you need to, and you're good to go, so you won't lose it. Also, the nice part is throughout the night, we're eating food, we're having drinks, you know, anything that could happen, you don't want to damage your bag. So if the oil's on your hands as you get throughout the night, touch the bag, you do have the risk of damaging it. Don't worry, we're not gonna do that because you have the wristlet there. 
absolutely stunning piece. And this one is only $995. These are no longer in production, so the only place you can get them is on the pre-loved market. And what I love about this is normally when you see the white Murakamis, a lot of times they weren't in good condition when coming to the pre-loved market. So they're oftentimes yellowing or very damaged. Here you can see virtually nowhere to that VBN Vachetta trim all the way around. To that beautiful zipper here. It's gold brass hardware. Louis Vuitton discontinued the Murakami collection around 2014, 2015. So the only place you can get it is here at what goes around, comes around on the pre love market and in this best condition. So $995 for this incredible piece. I absolutely love it. I can't believe it. And then the interior has, of course, the beautiful red Alcantara micro suede lining. So Alcantara basically is, like I said, a micro suede. It's not real suede, but it has a feeling like that. Actually, the person who kind of first came out with that, because it's stain resistant, water resistant, and stain resistant, was Holston. He actually was kind of the first person to come out with that kind of layering material. And they went crazy for it on the coats, because water would just roll right off. Suede, if it's exposed to the elements, will damage very quickly. And they oftentimes use it in luxury cars because it's ensuring that you can easily clean it. And that's what I love that Louis Vuitton does. They're trunk makers, and they think about everything for functionality so that this piece will last you a lifetime. $995 for this amazing item. I still can't get over it. And 33 different colors? That's insane. It's a beautiful, beautiful piece. Easily add to cart here at, on what goes around comes around site. It's also available on our Amazon. So easily add to cart. Of course, we will get to you as quick as possible whenever you need it. Let us know if you have any issues. Feel free to put it in the chat or reach out to us at live shopping at WGACANY.com. But we're on Amazon, we're on Facebook, YouTube, we are coming to you everywhere. You're never gonna get rid of us. Don't worry, more are coming soon. Once again, $995 for this incredible item. All right, ooh, we heard that zipper, didn't we? We love it. Now I'm excited to bring out another item. Something simple, classic, you'll have forever. This is the Prada Black Safiano Leather Envelope Clutch with this beautiful gold hardware. I love the Prada symbol. I love the way you do this symbol. So the triangle on Prada that we normally see, that was created to show the symbol of luxury by Mario Prada, who created Prada in 1913. They're celebrating their 110th anniversary this year. But when they kind of redone some of the logo, it's still within a triangle form, and I love that they've kept that. So there's little attention to details there. But here it is, an envelope clutch. You can never go wrong with an envelope clutch. I'm having to stop myself because the handbag historian in me wants to talk about when envelope clutches first came around, why they've been around for so long, all of that. But basically, they've been around for over 100 years. They were one of the very first clutches to come out alongside Lucite Minotiers. See, I kept it short. Good for me. But it is Safiano leather trim, which I love, not leather trim, it's part Safiano leather. But there's another part here. We also have this smooth calf leather on each side. The back is still Safiano leather, but you get that dual leather, which you barely almost see. But if you see it now, see how this is almost shining, reflective? It's that smooth calf leather. It's meant to do that. Safiano leather, it is scratch resistant, water resistant, and stain resistant. Just like we had the Epsom leather on the blue Izmir GJ clutch, that is also Epsom. This is Prada's version of Epsom. And then of course, you have the calf leather. But what I love, Prada was so smart for this. When you're carrying the clutch, you're going to carry it where the soft on leather is. That's where you're gonna hold it. So less likely to damage anything where this calf leather is very sensitive. So you still get that beautiful look of the calf leather, but no worries about damaging it. See these brands? They think of everything. And then, it's just a beautiful snap closure here. We have that calf leather on the interior and see how it all kind of matches up now. Really elegant and beautiful. I love the small detail here in the middle. I know that's where they're just basically lining it up, but to me that looks gorgeous. And then of course, Prada made in Italy here on the interior. And then you have just a nice interior there as well. It turns into canvas in the bottom for easy cleaning. And then you have a slip pocket here and a slip pocket in the back. But the slip pocket in the front has 
Uh, six credit card slots, three on each side. And then, of course, we have the back pocket. Very minor wear, so there's just some markings to the interior. And then this pocket expands, so you can keep your credit cards back here, something that you easily need to get, so you don't have to open the clutch, or anything else that you might need. It does expand a little bit on the side. I would not recommend putting anything too big in here. You could put your phone, but not for long periods of time, I would recommend, because it will stretch out the leather. But that is okay. It is also yours to use. So if you know you'll never get rid of this piece, do whatever you want. It's yours. This piece, you're not going to believe it, $450. What? Only $450, you heard me right. Absolutely insane. Incredible price. Look, no corner wear. Flat clutch, easy. This is one of those pieces I brought on, like the key ball from a couple days ago for our travel series that I shouldn't have brought on because I love it so much. Beautiful. You're lucky it's gold hardware. Right now I'm not in my gold phase. Maybe in a couple years I'll come back, but right now I'm not. So, I'm happy I brought this to you all. Only $450 for a Prada wallet slash clutch. Can you believe that? I meant to say Prada clutch slash wallet because you could use it as a wallet as well. And that's what I love about some of these clutches. They're versatile. Easily throw it down into your larger bag. You're good to go. Or take it to any event you need to. $450 for this amazing, amazing item. Wow. Okay, let's get into our next piece. Similar to the Gucci wallet on chain, I am bringing you another very versatile piece. This is the Saint Laurent pink chevron quilted leather grain de poudre wallet on chain, or walk as we love to call it in the handbag collecting fields. Beautiful chevron quilting. If you've heard me say this before, I also like to refer to it as the Y quilt. Saint Laurent or Yves Saint Laurent we know it's Saint Laurent now because Heidi Salmain dropped the E's when he came to uh, Saint Laurent, Yves Saint Laurent. Tongue twister there, basically. But he dropped the E's, but they kept the symbol, which we love. Actually, I heard, I was just reading a book, and I heard them literally say in the book, I've never been this angry until it, they dropped the E's from Saint Laurent. I was crying. Like, that is literally the funniest thing I've ever heard. So I hope you guys are laughing too about that. But back to this. Chevron quilting, grain de poudre, which basically just means grain of powder. Just another name, kind of like what Carl Lagerfeld did with the caviar leather. It looks like little caviar eggs. This looks like little grains of powder to Heidi Salmain or the designer of this bag at the time. And of course we see luxury here is how all the quilting matches up. You open this up, it continues throughout. This is removable, so you can easily carry it if you need to. This one is just the envelope clutch. The cake clutch is the one that actually isn't an envelope, it's just the square below, which was named after Kate Moss. But this is very similar. This just has, the only difference is that it has a triangle point rather than just the flat point, the flat flap, I mean. $1,825, this is the perfect color. You could use this for the summertime, into the early fall and even in spring. And during the winter if you want to, if you wear all black, this would actually be a great holiday party look as well. So I love it for summer though. Now that's what we're in. Beautiful gold hardware. That symbol actually, the YSL, was created by the famous artist Cassandra in the 60s, 1963 I believe. So Yves Saint Laurent and Pierre Bourget, they were basically partners in business and life partners, came to Cassandra and said, make us a logo and we have this timeless logo. So even though the Yves from Yves Saint Laurent was dropped, we still see it remaining here. Don't forget we have this beautiful interior. Just a minor press mark here. But other than that, this is in excellent condition. I mean, there are 10 credit card slots there. You have a slip pocket here as well. Zip pocket. And then you have a compartment there. Another compartment here with 10 more credit card slots. You have a total of 20. So don't worry. You can bring everything with you. Your health benefits card, your dental and vision, just in case. You never know what's going to happen at a party and you might need an emergency tooth repair. So then you can have your insurance. And then I said slip pocket in the back. I love slip pocket in the front. Zip pocket in the middle, once again for that jewelry or anything else you bring with you. 
I always put, whenever I have a clutch that has a zip pocket, I put my, if I'm out of town, put my hotel key in there. Because the amount of times you get up to the hotel and you're like, I've lost my key, I have to tramp all the way back down, tramp all the way back up. It's just awful. So that's where I always put the hotel key. Then you have, of course, the change shoulder strap. We love this. And then it's just a magnetic closure there on the front. Or snap closure, apologies, snap closure there on the front. And then look, no corner wear, no base wear either. Fantastic condition. I love how it basically, see how much room it had in there? Look how thin it looks. Fantastic. And this is where, if you're done wearing it, it still gives you that high class look. And I love that. That very luxurious look that you could wear this anywhere to a gala, to a wedding. Beautiful piece. It would fit crossbody, but I think with this style, it's better so you're just on the shoulder. But if you need to, crossbody hits my chest. I'm six foot five, so if you're below six feet, it will just hit right above your hip there. Once again, only $1,825 for this incredible piece. A lot of people actually don't realize Yves Saint Laurent, Saint Laurent bags, they actually retain their resale value very well, almost very close to retail, which is kind of incredible. So this is a great piece. You take good care of it. Absolutely incredible. $1,825. Easy click buy at to cart. And let me know, once you guys do buy it, just tell me you bought it and we'll, yeah, we'll pop the, I don't have champagne. You can pop the champagne. We'll pop it together when you come to New York and visit us. $1,825 for this amazing piece. Okay. Moving on to our next item. By the way, my sandwich, I can smell the truffle sauce coming from it. And nothing makes me more excited than truffle. It smells so good. So let's get through these bags. <laughs> but here I have, oh, you know what? Anything that trumps truffle are the handbags. That's what trumps it. So here we have this beautiful piece. This is a Chanel metallic bronze caviar leather half moon clutch slash wallet on chain. I love this piece. Look at that detail below. And I'm sure you can see that little peak of quilting we're getting there. I love that they only did the quilting on this basically pleated area. The rest of it is just plain caviar leather. It is absolutely incredible. Look at this item. We got all these beautiful details on here. I can't get over it. This is from 2012. And it's only $3,150. It is no longer in production. Most walled on chains are achieving above $4,000. So I always say if you love a classic, but you want something just a little bit different, but still has that same function as the classics do, this is the perfect item for you. $3,150 from 2012. No exterior wear to it. Just a little bit of creasing, which happens with this leather over time. Then of course we have a magnetic closure. That magnet is still very strong, so you're not gonna have to worry about that whatsoever. Makes a great clutch. I love this, it'd be great for any charity event, any gala, or gala, why'd I say gala? Dinner, anything like that. And then this is great too, just for a night out or a date night or anything. But then of course you have that chain, it has that metallic bronze caviar leather running through it and then I just love the quality of this chain and I love when it just circles into your hand down like this like beautiful and it's silver hardware I think I said this yesterday on the show there's nothing I love more than when Chanel, Louis Vuitton, Hermes, Balenciaga, Saint Laurent, the list goes on, Prada when they do a metallic bag and instead of keeping the hardware like gold because it is metallic bronze or the metallic silver with silver hardware, they do it a little different. And this is the silver hardware of metallic bronze. So it just adds a little bit of contrast, a little difference that we just absolutely love to see. $3,150. And let's not forget that stunning interior. And then look at that. Look how those pleats come up. Beautiful design. Basically, they're gathering it here at the bottom almost like into a box pleat where they basically stitch it and then lap 
back over, stitch it over again, and so it creates this beastly function. A lot of the time we see this in gowns, wedding gowns, dresses, especially the gowns you're gonna to wear to all these events that you need this bag at. And look at that, absolutely beautiful front pocket, still functional. It almost doesn't look like it is, but boom, secret pocket. We love that. Zip pocket here, once again for coins or the essentials. Then we have, of course, this part here is a metallic bronze, great for card holders, license, anything that you need. But then you also have six card holders here as well. Lined in canvas, so easy for clean, cleanability. And I do love that it's a lighter color, especially at night. Actually very interesting where the contrasting linings came from, where in the early 1800s, we had the sailor bag here. When sailors were brought onto ships, basically, they had their sailor bags, the ditty bags, and they were not allowed to bring trunks because under a certain ranking. So they brought these bags, but the bags were made of black cloth. So at night it was hard to find anything. So they would start lining them in light browns and whites and beiges. And that is why we still see this today. It's so that it could easily be found even in the dark. So you can still kind of see within your bag. Love that feature to it. Once again, $3,150. This is no longer in production. By the way, I am a nerd when it comes to space. I love learning about space. So anything that has the word moon in it or anything like that, I love it. By the way, I won our science fair in 2000, in 2000, not 2000, in eighth grade. Won my seventh, yeah, eighth grade science fair or seventh grade science fair, doesn't matter. But I made a moon dial. Even did the whole calculations and everything. So I won first place, just saying, killed it. Was a nerd then. Still a nerd now, but just for handbags. The half moon clutch, because basically the moons, the different angles they give, or angles, the, see, now I can't remember what they are. But, you know, there's not always the full moon. Here's the half moon version. Beautiful, and you get that Chanel logo, which I love. $3,150 for this incredible piece. Okay. We're moving on to another GJ. So let me get my gloves out. This piece is actually really, really cool. This color is hard to get and hard to find. And it's a little bit of a pop of color. Where that is mere blue, we love that blue. But this color is really just the standout color. Okay. Here we have the Hermes Anamones, that color, Epsom, Gige, a GJ or Gij Alon 29 from 2014. Once again, it is Epsom leather. And this piece is basically just absolutely incredible, similar to the Blue Izmir one. Nowhere to this bag, no corner wear on the exterior whatsoever. The interior, beautiful, slight markings to the interior, but very faint, almost unnoticeable. Of course, got to keep that dust bag in there. Look at that beautiful lambskin lining. It is tonal. The reasons they look a little different in color, I'll explain that here in a second. So, oh, and then of course we have the silver stamping here for hot stamping. So there is no hardware on this bag. I think it was actually Hermes's first hardware list bag. And basically, it would have been palladium or silver hardware. So we love that. But basically, the Epsom leather, it's very popular but it is a stamped grain leather that is very lightweight, it's durable, easily cared for it, as we've said, and it's actually not as soft, and that's the point, so this is a remain structured. Scratch resistant, water resistant, stain resistant, so it's great for clutches because the oils on our hands won't damage the bag, that layer will stop it. So Epsom was actually released in 2004 and has remained a staple for almost 20 years at Hermes, but before that, it had a predecessor. That leather was called Coarse Chevelle, and did not really look any different the, except for a few things. So Coeur Chevelle, it discontinued in 2004 and Epsom immediately replaced it. It's basically glossier and a little bit darker. So Epsom leather, when you put Epsom leather onto a color, it brightens it up a little bit. When you put the Coeur Chevelle onto a leather, like a, just a classic toga or anything, it would slightly darken it. So that's how you could kind of tell the difference. And then of course the year of production. But just seeing the bag, you can always kind of tell 
Epsom leather, it does have a small sheen to it, but Coeur Chevelle would have a larger sheen, so it'd be a lot more reflective, a lot more shiny, more lisse as they would call it. So I love that. So that's why lambskin leather retains that color, makes it a little bit darker where this is just slightly lighter. That is all because it's the way they uh, dye the colors and put them in different leathers. That's why some colors are only available in exotics or certain leathers at Hermes because if they were uh, basically available in uh, anything they wanted, it would not stay consistent. And Hermes is all about perfection and they want these bags to reflect what they're seeing. So they may dye, let's say, a Togo leather in a beautiful color and they're like, you know, it's not looking great there, but it looks great on alligator and crocodile. Or it may just look good on lizard. For instance, berets, you only see it in exotic skins. I think personally it's beautiful because they have the chev leather lining on the interior. That's the only time you'll see it. But that's the reasoning. Oh, and look at this piece. So beautiful. Once again, it's all about love for this item. You're not going to believe it. $4,500 because Anamone is so hard to find. Beautiful piece. Let's bring out the Izmir again. This one was originally $4,500, but it's on promotion for only $3,100. And I want to say it was $50. That is correct, $3,150. And then, of course, we have the Anamone here. And it's all about color. Even though they're the same bag, people always ask me, why are the prices slightly different? It's all about desirability and color. Blue Izmir, I mean, this color is fantastic. Absolutely beautiful. And I can't believe it actually is on promotion for that low. I mean, look, it fell over. It was so surprised. It just fell over because, like, I'm how much? So, needs to go home, $3,150. Because Anamone's a little harder to get, $4,500 for this amazing piece. Look at these clutches. I mean, you can't go wrong. I love them. I eventually want every color in these. So beautiful. Okay, next we're getting on to a clutch. This size is no longer in production, everyone. So, we're going to have to get, this is another Hermes piece. This is the Hermes in the color Tundra, which is no longer in production. So hard to find Tundra, so it's kind of amazing to see it here. Box, calf, calf box, leather. Medor clutch in the size 29 with gold hardware. So they no longer make the size 29 in this. This is a very large item. I love this piece. Absolutely stunning. And it's in great condition for box calf. You're not going to believe it. Only $4,950 for this amazing piece. Beautiful. This one's from 2008 originally. Like I said, the size is discontinued. And basically, the Medor is basically the Calais de Gien, which is the dog collar. So the Calais de Gien was designed for dogs. So they're part of their dog line, their pet line from Hermes. And one of the clients fell in love with it and won it as a belt. So since then, it's stayed a collection for, I think, close to like 70, 80, 90 years within Hermes. They've done it in many different ways. So they have four studs here, just like the Collier de Chien would have. And then this part slides up, comes off there, and then the clutch opens up. But look, it goes all the way around here. See that? Beautiful. And then this is all just one piece of leather. The exterior is one piece of calf box leather with two sides leather and then that chev interior which is tonal tundra once again here we're seeing a fine example of the slight difference in chev leather it appears more gray and the box calf leather has more of a green undertone to it beautiful this color i would say is in between a taupe and a tame beautiful piece and i love the hardware Minor scratches to it, but it is in great condition. And where the scratches are, this piece covers it anyway, so you will be just fine. Once again, $4,950. Absolutely incredible item. Beautiful. And by the way, Madur, I now have this theory. So Madur, it basically doesn't translate to anything, but it's basically a typical name for the French dog. So I think whoever they originally created the Calais de Chien for, Hermes won't ever tell us this, but I think whoever they created the original Calais de Chien for, 
their dog's name was Mador. So I think that is the name for it. By the way, one time I was with a client, her dog, beautiful dog, had an emerald necklace, giant emerald on it. I mean, I want to come back in my next life as that dog. But the dog passed, very sadly. She buried the dog with the necklace. I mean, I'm not going to say it. Where's the dog buried? <laughs> so, once again, $4,950 for this amazing piece. And if you love dogs like I do, I have a beautiful son, Bandit. He is my child. I don't care what anyone says. This is a great piece. Kind of pays homage to that in such an Hermes, basically collector's piece. $4,950. And then, of course, it comes with the Hermes dust bag. We try to bring all the accessories possible. And don't worry, we'll always gift you a what goes around comes around dust bag as well. I love a double dust bag. And I forgot to mention, it has that slip pocket on the interior there. Easily go in just like this. And that's the great part. It's technically adjustable. You can have it really on any length you want. So I love that. By the way, I feel like now I need gloves with like our logo, what goes around comes around on it. <gasps> I have to look into that. That'd be fun to have. Okay, now we're going to move on to this beautiful piece. Look at this. Wow, wow, wow. This is the Chanel Pink Python CC Mini Clutch with silver hardware. This is from Spring Summer 2012. That was the Chanel Underwater Under the Sea collection. Look at that, absolutely beautiful. And look at that Python on the back. Python on the pre love market is so hard to find. Oftentimes the scales are starting to turn up starting to dry out. That means they have not been kept properly. But here what goes around comes around. Every piece goes through a rigorous authentication process and condition check. We oftentimes get pieces in and sometimes it'll take a month to get to us because we want to ensure every aspect of that item is perfection before we bring it to you all. In this piece, we have everything here is climate controlled, so the temperature, the humidity, everything. So that's why this piece is still in such fantastic condition. And by the way, that Chanel underwater collection, beautiful. This pink here, this pink was inspired because it had a lot of pearl essence to it. And basically, if you ever owned been seen inside of a, an oyster where the pearls would be, the under tier of it is oftentimes pink. And oftentimes, sometimes the pearls will give off a little bit of pink essence to it. And so will the underwater sea. So that's where this inspiration of this color came from. You know that CC logo, which is a little bit pronounced, and then it is filled, instead of with enamel or just leather, with that beautiful Chanel pink python. By the way, Chanel no longer produces exotics. They stopped in 2018. So the only place to get an exotic item is here on the pre-love market. Most of the time, these bags would go for over $10,000. We're not gonna believe it, only 4,000. $950 for this amazing piece. There is virtually nowhere to the Python exterior. And there is extremely minor wear to the interior lambskin lining, which is in that tonal pink. Look at that. Beautiful. And one of the ways we can tell it's an exotic item is that Chanel has these metal plaques on them. It's one of the authentication tips. You then, of course, have the push lock here, which states Chanel on it, and then the metal silver frame all the way around. That collection was gorgeous. YouTube, the uh, show, and honestly, the best part about it was Florence Welsh of Florence and the Machine. She has the most beautiful voice in the world. She performed. Karl Lagerfeld was obsessed with her, so she performed at that show absolutely incredible. She was actually on the runway performing, so I love that. And Carl, actually, if you look at all the beautiful architecture they did, he compared his underwater set like that of a Zahad Hadid architectural design. 
So you see how all of this all comes together. This is a piece of artwork. We have architects at Louis Vuitton have designed bags for Louis Vuitton, like Frank Gehry. So that's what I love. So much inspiration. All of these industries really do take inspiration from each other. Beautiful piece. Once again, only $4,950. Most exotics go for above $10,000 retail and on the pre-loved market. So only $4,950 for this amazing item. And if you're worried about caring for it at home, like I said, it does need to be temperature controlled. All that means is do not put it into a place that's anywhere above 72 degrees Fahrenheit. And you do have a place, it is your closet. Never leave it in front of a window. I hope you don't have uh, windows in your closet. If you do, tape it up, get rid of them, call your contractor immediately. We're done with them. But if you don't put this in there, humidity in your house normally stays between 65 Actually, I think 60% and 70%, which is normal. So that's what you oftentimes will need as well, or even a little bit lower. I think it's 50% low, can go humidity wise. So this will be just fine in your home. Just don't put it anywhere that's overheating or anything of the such. $4,950 for this iconic runway piece, a little over 10 years old. Never gonna see it again. So here only what goes around comes around. Absolutely incredible item. Okay, let's move on to Another good old Hermes clutch. This is the Hermes olive green box Cali cut with gold hardware. Isn't this incredible? Look at this. Absolutely stunning. Swift. Now it's box leather, apologies. It's the box leather. And look, normally this is from 2009 almost 14 years old. Normally you see box has some wear to it, not here. You get to do the wear to it when you purchase this piece. And by the way, the Kelly cut, we know the Kelly bag was named after Grace Kelly and the Kelly has originally came about in the 1930s slash 20s. It was named the Sac de Pêche. And of course, when Grace Kelly carried it, she found the bag when she was in the movie to catch a thief was obsessed with it, basically asked Hermes to make every color in it for her, and she has that famous photo of her shielding her baby bump from the paparazzi when she got out of the car with the Kelly bag. And in the 70s, Hermes renamed it the Kelly. So then, ever since Margiela and then Jean-Paul Gaultier, who's a big factor, he then came in and kind of created bags. So he created the 2004, he created the Kelly Pochette, which is a smaller version than this, slightly bigger. And then in 2008, he created the Kelly Cut. I love it. I like to describe it as if like, you know, if you have a, normally have a newspaper under your arm, this is like that. Just throw it easily under there. You know, you look chic and sophisticated. In the mornings when you have your newspaper because you're reading it, you're educating yourself, it's being smart and chic, you throw this under your arm for the evening events. And I love it here. It has plastics on the hardware on this piece over here on the plaque, not on the second plaque though. Plastic still on the plaque here on the front and the plastic on the Torres plaque here. Lambskin leather lining and then chev here. Lambskin here at the top and then chev here at the bottom. Hermes logo on the interior, which I love they do instead of trying to fit it up there. And then you have a slip pocket here as well. And I love when you carry these bags. Easily you can hold it like this and it will look chic. Or what I've seen other people do. They will type it here and then just hold it right there as the one. Or pop them both on. Carry it like that. Or another way is you put the straps underneath. I've seen people do that. And you have two centimeter drop here, so it's easy just to put my hands fit in there, so yours will just fine. By the way, everyone joining us from Amazon, Facebook, thank you guys all so much for tuning in along on YouTube as well. If you have any questions, feel free to throw them in the chat box. If you see any bags that you may not see here on the show that are available on Amazon or Facebook or anything, come over to us at whatgoesaroundnyc.com. Easy as a click and add to box. I had to cart or a box. We'll send you a box of goodies, especially if you add a few things to your cart. And then of course, we always have 
our beautiful what goes around dust bags that will come with each purchase. Beautiful gold hardware. This piece, $15,500. This color, olive, which they call ver olive, which just means olive green, is no longer in production. So the only place you can get it here is on the pre-loved market. Designed by Jean-Paul Gaultier once again in 2008. Absolutely incredible piece. He really, I love Jean-Paul Gaultier's time at Hermes. He really took so many classics, just like Marc Jacobs at Louis Vuitton, and turned them into iconic pieces we still have today. Once again, $15,500, virtually nowhere to this item. Absolutely beautiful. Love this piece. Okay. Now we move on to another versatile bag, similar to the wallet on chains that I have brought out. This one is not a wallet on chain, so do not worry, but it is still such a cool piece. This is the Chanel Black Lambskin Chocolate Bar East West Medium Flat Bag with Gold Hardware. I love this piece so much. It is absolutely incredible. And this is what Karl Lagerfeld did. He kept the classics, but he would just turn them a little bit on their head. Instead of making the diamond quilt, he turned it into just square quilt. Just shifted it a little bit. There you go. This is from 2003, 2004 era. They stopped producing it really in 2011, the East West Flat Bag. So once again, the only place you can get them, pre-love market here. And at what goes around comes around, we're gonna give you the best condition out there. This piece, so incredible to find it in this good of condition. Not only is it black, because a lot of time they were in brown or many other colors, but this is black, gold hardware, and then of course, lambskin leather. Can you believe that? And how good of condition? I see no corner wear. This bag is 20, well, 19 to 20 years old. Let's not age you. Don't worry, I won't age you. And it is still incredible condition. By the way, 2003, 2004 era, that means the hardware is still 24 karat plated gold. As you can see here with that beautiful insignia, that is how we can tell. They basically stopped doing it around 2005. There's no exact date, but we normally see after 2005 items no longer with the 24 karat plated gold. We then have that beautiful flap. Look at that. Wow, virtually nowhere. There's just one or two marks to the bag, but absolutely incredible to find this condition. And don't forget, one of my favorite authenticity tricks here, for Chanel, they use flatheads, screws, for most of their hardware. 99.99% of the time, it is flathead. There are very few exceptions for Phillips head, which are kind of their acrylic pieces, backlit pieces. Anyways, we'll talk about that later when we have one. But most of the time, you see the flathead. So when we see that, that is a really great sign. One of just hundreds of authenticity tricks that go into to ensuring we're bringing you authentic items. You get your Chanel logo here. And then this part, I love they kept this. They kept the three pockets that you normally see on a classic flat bag, the lipstick pocket, compact pocket, wallet pocket, or whatever else you need to use them for. Lip gloss, for chapstick. I've ran out of things to put in there. Anything tubular you can put in there. And then of course your wallets on either side. There are no additional pockets there, but we do have our made in France stamp here. And then, just in case you don't want to wear it as a clutch anymore. Here you go, you can easily throw it on your shoulder. It does not fit cross body unless you're small enough. I think under five feet you could, but I love how versatile this item has become. So simple at any event. If you're tired of holding it, easily throw it over your shoulder and you have that classic black and gold leather woven chain lambskin leather woven that was created by Karl Lagerfeld. Of course, Coco Chanel came up with the chain idea, but he added that leather weaving, weaving into it. I love that it did that. It does make it a little bit more lightweight and just adds that little extra piece of detail and refinement to it. I just love this piece. Just wanna look at it for a minute. I think this will go great with my outfit. By the way, I have not talked about my outfits in a minute, so I think I need to quickly. I, of course, am wearing an Hermes tie. And then I am wearing this beautiful Giorgio Armani silk tuxedo uh, double-breasted blazer. I got this basically on the resale market 
for like $110. And it actually says on the interior, one side is a Giorgio Armani, and on the other side it says Bergdorf Goodman. Fantastic, we love it. And of course my pants are by my custom tailor, Stephen Tabak from Beck and Spoke Fabrics here in New York City. If you're ever here, happy to connect you with them. And then of course, I don't know if you can see my shoes, but this is why I wore the red tie. It's my red Manolo uh, Blahnik silk slippers that match my red tie. I love matching my accessories. I feel like it's very like old school and I'm into it. And this would be my clutch for wherever I'm going to after this, which is home. I'd wear this at home. Yep, just lounging around like this. $5,250 for this piece. You cannot beat that price because flat bags, if this was in production now, it'd be close to $8,000. The classic double flats are already over $10,000 retail. So here, at what goes around comes around, you get this piece, one that's not in production anymore. 2011 is when they stopped producing these. Chocolate bar collection is no longer around. Carl Lagerfeld design, and you're all set. $5,250, and I left off one component that you're not gonna believe. Let's say you don't wanna wear it as a shoulder bag. Guess what? You don't have to, because you can also wear it as a chic wristlet, just like this. Or I've seen so many people who are just like too cool, who I follow on Instagram, look at that. You can also wear it like this. Look how fun that is. Or somehow, I don't know how, I don't know how they do it, but make it a waist belt bag. <gasps> You could, if you have two pockets here on the side. See, I figured it out. I, I'm gonna be an influencer. I've got this, I can do it. Loop it here, loop it to the other side, and you're there. We love it. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you all once again for tuning in on Amazon and everywhere, so excited to have you all. Little piece, just gonna pop this back there. Struggling here for a minute, that's all right. And it does come with its authenticity card and it comes with the care card as well. And don't forget, it has one of our what goes around comes around dust bags always. We love these pieces. And for stuffing these bags that are, like I've said, a little bit thinner, just the dust bag will do. Lay it down in there and you are all set. Okay. Let's move on to our next item. This is another Hermes black box calf leather Maydor 29 with gold hardware. This one's from 2007. Wow, look at that condition, I just can't believe it. And by the way, there is still plastic on this part of the clutch, which means there is no scratching underneath, and you're not gonna believe only $5,500 this size, the 29, is no longer produced. Absolutely incredible condition. By the way, box calf leather is what Hermes calls their heritage leather. Sometimes they call it bow leather. So it's Hermes's oldest leather when they use to produce handbags. I love box calf. And it's basically a very fine grain leather and it develops a beautiful patina over time when you use it. And I'm sure you guys have all seen the articles like I have and I'm obsessed with it where they basically talk about how, you know, is the beat up bag the new trend? Obviously here, what goes around comes around condition is a very big factor to us when bringing these items, but these are pieces, heritage pieces. These are meant to last forever and they're meant to be worn and loved. So when you do buy this piece, start enjoying it, start using it. If you get a few marks on it, that's totally fine. It is yours to love. Now, if you do plan on reselling it a few years later, you just want to use it for a few events and then resell it, then I would not recommend doing that. <laughs> but if you are planning on holding on to this, passing this down to your kids, to your nieces, your nephews, to whoever, to your, you know, like Carl Lagerfeld did, to Chopet, his cat, you plan on passing this to your animals, use it and enjoy it and love it. Once again, no longer in production, $5,500. Hermes's original classic leather, beautiful piece. By the way, there are so many versions of box cap from so many brands. And I really shouldn't say this, but I think Hermes does it best when it comes to box calf leather. I absolutely love it. My Gige that my partner got for me, it's in box calf. It's perfection. And guess what? 
at Lexol, which you can get on Amazon if you've watched our How to Care for Your Bags video. If you've not, let's go to whatgoesaroundnyc.com, click the Live Shopping tab, scroll down, you'll see the video there, How to Care for Your Handbags. Very easy, it's a two-step two leather conditioning and cleaning process, easy to smooth over, and it cleans and it conditions box calf leather so well. Oh my gosh, I'm blown away, look at that. I see virtually no wear. Wow, almost impossible to find. And from 2007, we're talking 16 years old and look at this condition. Absolutely incredible. Comes with an Hermes dust bag. You have the beautiful Chev lining there on the interior. That slip pocket there, beautiful. Just a couple markings over here to the side. But other than that, this is absolutely impeccable. I can't believe the condition on this piece. And the price, only $5,500 for a piece that's no longer in production in this size. They do still make the smaller version, but I would prefer this larger version. I think it is just so cool. We have the Collier de Chien in here, as we've talked about. Collier de Chien, for those who are just joining, that is basically a dog collar is what it means in French. And Hermes, when they had the dog collar, they had a client who was kind of drawn to it and was like, can you make me a belt like this? And they're like, sure, why not? Because Hermes loves doing custom things. By the way, you still can go to Hermes and get custom items made, which is incredible. If it's a Birkin, it's a little hard to do that, but other items happily to make for you as long as you pay the price tag. But I love it because they've kept it throughout their collections for over 70, 80 years, and the Medor, Basically, it's like a dog's name, and I truly think, Hermes will probably keep that secret forever, but I think whoever asked for the Calais de Chien to be made, they named, their dog's name was Medor, and that's why they call it the Medor. Beautiful. Once again, $5,500 for this beautiful piece. Box leather, we absolutely love it. All right. I know we were just kind of doing more classic refined there, but don't worry, we're gonna get into some fun pieces here. Now I have for you this beautiful Louis Vuitton Stephen Sprouse monogram roses confetti pochette accessoires with gold brass hardware. This is from 2008. This is from my cool girls, from my downtown girls who, you know, I don't know where I'm going with this, but you wanna look cool. This is the cool bag. See, this is too cool for me. I couldn't wear this, but it's just so cool. But the story behind it is so amazing. Okay, before we get into that story, let's talk about that Bachetta trim it's from 2008. This is 15 years old. Virtually nowhere to that Bachetta trim. Only here are you gonna find that. And then you have that beautiful monogram coated canvas with the beautiful roses graffiti there. So this piece is $1,650. It is no longer in production probably won't ever be in production again unless they do another kind of series like they've done with Kusama, which is very different from the original Kusama collection that Louis Vuitton did. This is basically a re-release in 2008 in memoriam of Stephen Sprouse, who tragically passed away in 2005 at the very young age of 50. He was the first artist collaboration Marc Jacobs did with Louis Vuitton. So we have to thank Stephen Sprouse and Marc Jacobs and Louis Vuitton for what we see today. So it's sad that we do not have Stephen Sprouse here to see his beautiful creation still living out there and breathing, but you can make that happen by purchasing this amazing piece. And look, there's virtually nowhere to it. Honestly, the colors over camera are not doing justice because these are just some vibrant orange, vibrant pink and green. Absolutely like would bring tears to your eyes. Have that fantastic zipper with that great sound that we love canvas lining here. And by the way, these pochettes are so great because you can easily take off both sides of it if you need to and wear it as just the clutch or easily throw over your shoulder, crook your arm. Don't forget we have the wristlet option. Just like that. So many ways to wear this. $1,650. It is a piece of wearable artwork. Steven Sprouse art goes for crazy record-breaking prices at auction. So if you want a wearable piece of artwork, you can even display this in your home if you'd like to. I know one client one time who did 
had a bunch of Chanel belts and created basically a Chanel belt wall, but it almost looked like a piece of artwork. It was so cool. $1,650 for this incredible piece. It's available on Amazon, easy to click and buy, available here on what goes around comes around, nyc.com. Basically, easy to click, apologize, what goes around, nyc.com. And then, of course, here we are, just easily click to add to cart. And I will stay with you, even when you go to the checkout page, guess what, I minimize and I stay the whole time. So if you have any questions or run into any issues, just put it into the chat and we'd be happy to help you. $1,650. And we just got a follow on Amazon from Love, Peace, and Happiness. Thank you so much for following us. We're excited to have you. We have shows here every day, Saturday through Wednesday at 1.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And don't worry, as we grow, more shows will come. If there are any bags you want to see, let us know. Drop us a comment, a message. We'd be happy to bring them to you guys. Once again, $1,650 for this incredible item. All right. Let's move on to this fantastic piece. This is a Louis Vuitton Epi Neverfull pouch from the MM size Neverfull. So this color is called Corel, or just, you know, pink if you wish. And basically the Epi line was released in 1985, and then they did the Never Fools in 2013. Now you may ask, Mason, why are you selling just the pouch and not the Never Fool with it? We do sell the Never Fools with the pouch, but we of course also sell the pouches alone because sometimes they do come that way. They are so valuable. Sometimes people just love the pouches. Like I love the pouch, but they don't sell them separately at Louis Vuitton. So the great place you can get them is on the pre-love market. Epi leather is the first leather Louis Vuitton ever did came out in 1985 from an inspiration from a leather from the 1930s. And then of course, they created the Epi line of Neverfulls in 2013. This piece, only $675, can you believe that? Instead of, you don't really want the Neverfull paying those over $2,000 prices, you can just get this for $675. Absolutely amazing, from 2014, silver hardware. Look at that, fantastic condition. Absolutely amazing. You can really fit, when I tell you you can fit everything in here, you can fit everything. Has an Alcantara micro suede lining, easy to clean, stain resistant, water resistant, rolls right off. Thanks to Halston for that ingenious design. And then of course you have a slip pocket on the interior there. It fits an iPhone Max, it fits two iPhone Max if you need to, and it fits basically your wallet, you can fit cards, cash, all of it, everything you need, and you can easily wear it as a wristlet, or what I've seen other people do as well, if you want to wear it more as a different bag, you have this, and I'm sure Louis Vuitton thought of this, this little mark right here for the hardware, easily could wear it as a little pochette style. There you go, you have the bag in three different ways, three for one, $675. Beautiful piece, and I love Epi Leather. It has these grains, these grooves through it. You get the Louis Vuitton logo down here. So this is more for my people who love the quiet luxury, this is the way to go. And then of course, if you have a different bag, or let's say you have a never full, but you have a monogram, it's fun to mix it up. These are your items, play with them, have as much fun as you wish, so you can easily lash this into any key ring that you may have. $675, it's a steal. A steal, I'm sorry, I promise I wouldn't sing anymore. I'm not very good at it, but I love to do it. No corner wear, $675. Okay, I'm bringing out a couple of the Neverfull pochettes for you all. Now, of course, I'm gonna bring out a classic monogram. Here we have the Louis Vuitton classic monogram coated canvas Neverfull pouch, and this is also from an MM size of the Neverfull originally. So, like I said, the pouch was released in 2013, even though the Neverfull actually was released in 2007. So anything from 2013 on has the pouches. Basically, if it's before then, you won't have a pouch. So if you're ever wondering why I didn't get a pouch, but it's from like 2009, that is why. But guess what? Louis Vuitton doesn't sell them separately, but we do. We can find you the pouch. And if you're looking for the exact one to match, reach out to us on Instagram and TikTok. 
DM us at what goes around NYC and we'd be happy to find you that piece. We'll connect with one of our amazing stylists. But of course, by the way, follow us on TikTok. It is so much fun. TikTok is addicting and our videos are a hoot. You heard me right, I said a hoot. Love it. That's the country coming out in me. This piece is from 2015. Monogram coated canvas, as I mentioned. You, of course, get that beautiful pink accent there, which we'll show you on the inside why. And also, you can see here, you're probably wondering, I've said before, they keep basically the, um, the upright and the back right. You're probably wondering, it's two different pieces of leather. The Louis Vuitton Neverfull also has the upright and the back right, so they're just keeping it consistent throughout. Even though it's two different pieces of leather, this is the front, this is the back side. Does not mean it's inauthentic, it's actually a good signing when you see that. So if you see a speedy bag with the uh, front way and the back way, both upright, sorry that took me a minute to get out, it means it is most likely not authentic. But that's just one of many tricks to tell. Beautiful piece, $695. You have that Vivian Vachetta leather trim strap. It is a little bit darker, but it does not look worn. It just looks as though it has aged over time these past eight years of being out. It's patina together, which I kind of love. It will patina with you, as I love to say now. Gold brass hardware, and this is why you get that incredible contrasting kink lining that has the stripes throughout it. Slip pocket, just like the Epi version. Beautiful, easy to clean. There's no wear to the interior. This piece is in such great condition. No cracking on the edge paint either or corner wear. $695 for this incredible item. And like I mentioned before, you can wear it as a wristlet. You can put it into your bag, latch it onto something else. You can take it off completely if you need to. Or on this one, still have a little hook here. You can wear it as a pochette style. $695 for this incredible piece. Beautiful. All right, now this one is for my French lovers. Actually, this is for our wonderful moderator, Michelle. She is going to Saint-Tropez soon. This one is actually from the Saint-Tropez Neverfull. So, some locations do their own different uh, limited pieces. So like, Japan will have some limited bag items. Actually, I remember there was one piece that Hermes did that it was only for Dubai. And that is what I love, or, or Qatar. Either way, I can't remember, but it was one of the two. And beautiful, they do this for the Louis Vuitton Neverfull Road Classics. If you go to St. Bart, St. Tropez, even Aspen, they'll have the Louis Vuitton toes that say St. Tropez on it. They have a little bit of different design, and that's what I love about it. You can only get it at that store or here at What Goes Around Comes Around. So we're gonna bring it directly to you. This is the Louis Vuitton Pink Demi Azur Trunk Neverfull Pouch. You have that trunk painting basically on here. Louis Vuitton were trunk makers originally, so basically bringing that heritage out there again. And then the pink, very Saint Tropez vibes, very bright, very fun. Demi Azur, great for the summer. This is a great clutch to wear really anytime. I think you could have fun with this. It's a little bit more whimsical. If you like having a little more out there, a little more eccentric, this is a great piece for you, but still has that classic style to it. You have that gold brass hardware on top. The Vachetta trim here, which is in great condition. No visible signs of wear, except for just that little bit of patina that we oftentimes see. But other than that, there are no water spots or anything of the sorts. No cracking to the sides. And there is no corner wear. On a white piece, hard to find. Only here what goes around comes around. Are we going to bring you the best condition items out there? That interior, I love that. It's different from any of the other basically never full pouches you'll see. It's almost like that diamond quilt that they do based now on some of the newer leather bags. You have the Louis Vuitton logo on the interior. Slip pocket. Beautiful piece. There's no wear to this interior here. Canvas, so it's easy to clean. And once again, wristlet. Take the full thing off because you can remove this leather part here. It is just on there like a tab and you are good to go. And then, look at this. Just like that, the pochette. I know I keep doing it, but I love it. it doesn't it just look so chic like that? Once again, $615 for this amazing Saint-Tropez piece. Perfect. 
So yeah, Michelle, you need this in Saint-Tropez on your trip. It'd be the perfect piece to have. And I love it. Once again, $615 from 2018 originally. Easy click at Descartes. Done, done. Beautiful. And we just got another follower on Amazon. Thank you so much, my niece is my Nisha Snipes, I'm sorry, my Nisha Snipes, I apologize, I'm just tongue twisting here. Thank you so much, I know, isn't it so cute? We appreciate you, thank you so much for following us, we're excited to have you here with us. Beautiful. Mrs. Snipes, it's be easy just to click and add to cart. If you have any questions, let us know, we'll be happy to help you out here, what goes around comes around. All right. Let's move on to our next piece. This is the Louis Vuitton Demi Azur Eva Clutch and basically pochette. I love it. Gold hardware, discontinued in 2014. This is the 2013 one. So this is one of the last pieces before it was discontinued. I love it because you can easily remove it, the chain, wear it as a clutch. Such a versatile bag, so beautiful. Fits even over my shoulder, can you believe that? I mean, it completely disappears, but <laughs> it is fantastic. And I love this almost trapezoid shape that it has, the pleat down the side, and then you rarely see this with that plaque there. It's kind of a vintage style that they used to do. This is $1,630, and guess what? I'm not done. It comes with a crossbody strap. Isn't that incredible? And it comes with one of our fantastic tags. By the way, every single one of our tags has the authenticity guarantee. You just scan that barcode there, and it tells you everything about it. If you ever have questions, feel free to ask. Easily just put this on. And when I tell you, you can wear this bag three, four, five, six different ways, it is endless. There you go. And I love keeping the chain on. I think that just looks so chic. $1,630 for this incredible piece. Can you believe that? Demi Azur, virtually nowhere to the crossbody strap, minor scratching to the front plaque here, and then just a little bit of patina on the Vivian leather trim, that Vachetta trim. The interior, of course, unlined but with canvas. Beautiful piece, $1,630 for this great piece. Beautiful. All right, let's get on to our next item. After this, we're gonna take a short break, but don't you worry, we have so many more pieces to come. I am nowhere near done. Absolutely love this. This is something that's so cool. This is the Louis Vuitton Demier Abin Saint Louis, basically toiletry pouch with gold brass hardware, but it's not just a toiletry pouch because I'm going to show you why. Watch this. Ready? Actually, I need to take off my gloves for this because I'm not going to be able to get it out. But Dimier Abin, this is absolutely beautiful. It means checkerboard in French, basically a chocolate ebony checkerboard, but look at this cool feature. I'm going to do it on the side here. See? See this here? Boom, pulls out into a wristlet. Like, are you kidding me? Mind blown. I'm actually so excited. I almost said a curse word. I was that excited, like, but I'm not gonna say that, don't worry. And then you easily, boop, put it back in just like that, slides right in. You have this front pocket here. It states beautiful chocolate treated leather. I always say if you are less into the look of the patina over time from the Bichetta Vivian leather trim or on that on other Louis bags, this is a great alternative because it is a darker ebony chocolate leather and it's just been treated already. So it is a little bit more resilient and will look great over time. Your hands won't wear on it. The patina will not happen as much or as greatly and this will really stay from years to come. I mean, this is from 2003, this is 20 years old, and look how fantastic it is. 
fantastic condition. Great love uh, zipper sound. By the way, if the zippers have lasted 20 years, that's good quality zippers. That's great craftsmanship that we see from all these wonderful brands. Look at that beautiful Alcantara lining here. Micro suede as you will, slip pocket there. I would not use this as a toiletry pouch, even though it technically is. Absolutely not. By the way, only $950. Can you believe that? $950. It's a clutch. It's a hidden wristlet. And see, it is still just so tight in there, which I love, because that is really means that this is, has been cared for so well before it came to us. Fits over me easily, but if you're like, you know what? Nope, I'm going to a nice event. Just pop that right back in there. Easily just slides in, and you're good to go. Beautiful. Pocket in the front, it does fit an iPhone Max just fine. No cracking to the leather trim. No corner wear. Beautiful. Once again, $950. I really just love this piece. And I love, we never really mentioned, look how small that zipper is. But I love it because it's not too much and it just has a little hint of the LV on there. This is a wonderful Father's Day gift. Especially if, you know what, he needs a toiletry pouch, but your dad, like many dads are, they love versatility. They basically are like, you know what, if I can have, what is it, like those little Swiss Army knives where it has like a spoon in it, a toothpick, which, oh my gosh, all those things in it. They love that. They love when it's two for one. So, there you go. It's a great gift for them. They can use a toiletry bag or... They can then use it when they're running out and running errands to the grocery store or anything like that. Perfect piece, $950. Father's Day, by the way, it is next Sunday. So hurry up, get your gifts for our wonderful fathers here. We will ship it to you if you're worried about it, shipping to you too late. Just send us an email, live shopping at wgacany.com. Let us know in the chats and we'd be more than happy to get it priority for you, free of charge, of course. That's the wonderful experience you're gonna get here at Live Shopping. We're gonna ensure you get your items when you need them by. $950. Beautiful piece. Okay. All right, everyone, we are just going to take a short break, but we'll be back with you momentarily for so many good more items. We have Chanel, we have Gucci, so many cool things I can't wait to bring with you all. Thank you for hanging in there. We'll be back with you in one moment.
Hello everyone and we are back. We're coming back from just our short break and let's jump right back into some of the amazing items we're doing for clutches anytime. All right. I brought out basically every Louis Vuitton never, pou never full pouch that we've had, but we have so many more. So if you're not seeing the exact one you want, feel free to send us an email at live shopping at wgacany.com or you'll be happy to follow us on Instagram at what goes around NYC and on TikTok as well. Okay, here is this incredible piece we have here. Louis Vuitton, Demi Ben, Neverfull Pouch MM. This is from 2016. Of course, it was first released the Demi print, which just means checkerboard, in 1889 actually. And that was created by Louis Vuitton and his son, George Vuitton. And it basically was used to throw off the counterfeiters, but that was quickly easily replicated because everything was hand painted back then, by the way. So then they created Louis Vuitton monogram canvas after that. Yes, you heard me correctly. Demier came before monogram. But then in 1998, Marc Jacobs, one year after becoming creative director, decided to create the Demier print. So like I said, originally calling Demier meaning checkerboard, but Demier Ben means ebony checkerboard or basically chocolate, dark chocolate, dark brown checkerboard. Once again, you have that treated leather here. Beautiful. And this piece, only $525. Dollars. Stunning gold hardware here, that gold brass, beautiful red lining here, absolutely stunning. That no cracking, no wear to the corners, just an almost excellent store fresh condition. Once again, one of my favorite ways to wear it is as that pochette and for only $525, easy to get. And if you are having any trouble over on Amazon, just come over here to what goes around NYC and just .com and click on the streaming live button. We will pop right up and it's easy as add to cart. We apologize for any difficulties you're having on, over on Amazon today, but don't worry, we will surely get that fixed soon. Once again, $525 for this amazing item. Okay. We're gonna jump back to Chanel for just one moment. Here we have this beautiful, so cool, Chanel black caviar leather wristlet with gold hardware from 2019. This is $1,350. You have that classic diamond quilting we see all around, the classic small CC logo here, and then something I really have never seen before, the wristlet, it is so hard to see these on the Chanel items most of the time. Almost looks like a wallet, but you can easily wear this as a clutch, it is small enough. And look at that, it opens up. Great travel accessory as well. You have eight card slots, and I love that they're just like, almost like a slit, like you don't even know that it's there. The Chanel logo here, that burgundy lining. By the way, that burgundy comes from when Coco Chanel was um, at the orphanage, and she, her uniforms were burgundy. You then have the sl slip pocket here. Then you have the fun zip pocket. Easy to keep anything that you wanna keep um, safe. Earrings, a necklace throughout the night, anything like that, or your IDs. And then you have this classic snap closure. The back is also just a nice, beautiful, plain, gorgeous diamond quilting. And it just goes all the way around. Once again, only $1,350 for this incredible piece. Can you believe that? Absolutely unbelievable. $1,350. Beautiful. All right, now I'm about to bring out a trio of Louis Vuitton pochette accessoires. I'm so excited, this is all from the same collection and it's rare that you get to see all of them at once. So here we have these beautiful, I wish they stood up on their own, but that's okay. Louis Vuitton, this is the pink monogram perforated pochette accessoire. This is the Louis Vuitton orange monogram perforated pochette accessoire. And then finally, we have the Louis Vuitton green monogram perforated accessoire, 
all in gold brass hardware. I kept looking at the sites, I was like, is there one more? No, 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 we have them all, we have them all. So these are all from the Spring Summer 2006 collection. They do vary in price based on basically their availability when it comes to the colors. So the pink one we have here is $1,100. Look at that beautiful Pachetta trim. We even have that little slip pocket here up in the front there. Hard to get into there because these are still just so fresh. I love to keep the lock here. It gives a little different, a little something. And then of course you have the monogram coated canvas on the back, still with the perforated. And then we have the orange version. The orange version is $1,190. Same thing, all same accessories. You have the slip pocket here up front. It is perforated still, so you can see through it. Love this piece. And then of course we have the green one. This is $1,350. The green one is one of the hardest to find on the resale, pre-loved market. Beautiful. So I love it. This collection, the Spring Summer 2006 collection, Mark Jacobs did it was all about being over the top. For so long in the early 2000s, there was very little kind of over the top. It was more sleek, more subtle. So he was like, you know what? I'm bringing back the 80s. I'm gonna make it basically Y2K meets the 80s, and that's what they did here. Beautiful pieces. I absolutely can't get over them. Once again, $1,190 for the orange, $1,100 for the pink, and $1,350 for the green, all of which have almost no wear to the Vachetta trim, extremely minor wear and scratching to the hardware, all in fantastic condition. And we will just utilize the green one to show you the interiors, which they all look like. If you want to see a different one, let me know. Happy to pull it out. Of course, you're gonna have one of our great dust bags here. Like I said, it is perforated. So look at that interior there. It is that beautiful green contrasting interior. You have the microfiber suede here. Actually, you do have a card slot here as well. And then of course, you have the Louis Vuitton monogram here on the base. I love that they did not make that perforated, just in case. The hole, holes are small enough, nothing's gonna fall out. But just in case, I love it. So that's nice you have this little security basically piece here where no one will see your credit cards, your ID or anything. Just like that, beautiful piece. $1,350 for the green. You can take this off where it just is a clutch. I think that actually be really fun is just a clutch there. $1,350 for the green one. Minor patina, but other than that, no wear to this piece. You then, of course, have the pink one for only $1,100. Virtually no wear to the Vivian Vachetta trim. No corner wear either. $1,100, pink interior as well. And then lastly, but not least, for $1,190, we have the beautiful orange version of the perforated pochette accessoire. Absolutely stunning. If you want to see the interior of any of those, just let me know. I'd be happy to pull them back out. But I just love it. It's so rare when we get the collections of all the items together. So I oftentimes want to pull it out, even if it's too much for me at times. I'm like, don't worry everyone's gonna get their spotlight. And I was able to give those for those items. Thank you all so much for letting me have that moment. I really appreciate it for you letting me do that. <laughs> okay, now we're getting to a piece that actually I have rarely seen. I've only seen this a couple of times in my career. And all times are not in this great of condition. This is the Louis Vuitton Beige Monogram Vernis Fleur Lexington Pochette Accessoire. And it basically has that beautiful Vivienne Vachetta trim and the gold brass hardware as well. This piece is from 2002 and the color beige vernis was originally introduced in 1998 and then discontinued quickly in 2005. So you can only get it on the pre-loved market and this piece, they don't make the Lexington anymore, especially with these flowers. So the, the vernis leather is originally released in 1997 
and it was advertised, actually the bag was also, sorry, not the very new leather, the bag was originally released in 1997, and it was advertised in the Louis Vuitton catalog in 1998, and that's when Marc Jacobs actually just joined in 1997, and that's when they just came out with Verney at the same time in 97 as he joined. But the crazy part is, you know, I heard, oh, it came out in the catalog. I'm like, what about online? They did not have online back in 1997, 1998. So crazy to think that was not long ago, but that is true. So the only way you could have gotten this piece was in a catalog. This was one of the original colors alongside blue, pink, lime, and gray. And it has all these beautiful flowers on there. You have eight flowers on this side. And then on this side, you have seven flowers for a total of 15 flowers, which I love. Each Lexington will have the 15 flowers on it. There is nowhere, oftentimes you're hard to see, the Veronese starting to discolor over time normally, but not here, what goes around comes around. We're gonna bring you, look at that base. We're gonna bring you always the best condition items possible out there. Or it's not making it to you. And then of course, the VB and Vachetta trim, I don't see any minor markings or any major flaws on it. It's actually still in great condition. A little dark, the whole thing is a little patinaed, but that is just from age and it basically being 21 years old. <laughs> Beautiful piece, it's the Lexington there. And you can take this off and wear it as a clutch. I think it makes such a great clutch. Great bag for the summer. Also could go into the fall and the winter. I always say, you know what, if you love a monotone, I love monotone items. I love the monochromatic look. This is great. If you wear a lot of mono monochromatic beige or white, this would be that nice little pop, a little addition to it that has the flowers on there. This is kind of a nice bridge between maximalism and minimalism. And it's only $1,500. Can you believe that? Fauchette accessoires normally go much more higher north of that, but this is only $1,500. $500 for this amazing Lexington piece. Honestly, you could say one of the first kind of designs Marc Jacobs really did with the Verney leather would be one of these pieces, the Lexington. So this is really a piece of history or historic item you could have. By the way, does anyone else follow Marc Jacobs on Instagram? If you don't, you should. He is cracking me up. I don't know what it is, but he's basically just doing these photos in Paris, going around Paris, and he's literally just standing there like, it almost looks like a photo my dad would take and I'm living for it. He just has a Birkin, a Chanel jacket, and like ballet flats and like jeans. It's like, I don't know if jeans, maybe just pants, but it's just so funny. It's just like, take a photo of me. I love it. Cracking me up. He's living his best life. Once again, $1,500 for this incredible piece. Okay. Let me bring you into a little world of Balenciaga. This is, this is for like, you know, if you want to be cool, this is a cool piece. It's another very versatile piece you can wear as a clutch, the crossbody, or everything in between. This is the Balenciaga gray calfskin leather, papier triple bag, extra small with silver hardware. And of course it is a nice, brilliant silver, not the antique hardware we've seen on the original city bags, but I love this. They call it papier because when the leather originally came out, very thin like paper, so they decided to name it the paper edition, but papier in French. And I love this because normally they would have the names, like the totes would always be like A4, B5, A6, paper sizes basically. Sorry if I said those wrong. I'm a handbag historian, not a paper historian. But I do know pe people who are, so kind of crazy, a whole different world. Anyways, this piece is only $798. Definitely more of a casual look, easy to hold here but you're not gonna believe how much storage you have in this. Look, you have the front here. This will hold absolutely nothing, but that's okay. It's a pocket, we're gonna count it. You then, of course, have your front flap here with that magnetic closure. Don't forget the mirror. We love a mirror. Right there, I love that Balenciaga does their magnetic covers closed. This whole bag is basically almost magnetic. You then, of course, have this compartment right here and then that compartment there and one more the zip pocket here with the credit card slots in the back all with suede lining so that you really can keep this 
basically secure or anything as such. No corner wear or splitting or cracking. It is on Amazon. Once again, if you're having trouble on Amazon, just come over here to whatgoesaroundnyc.com. Click on that live shopping tab and we'll be happy to help you out. Say anything in the chat, click add to cart, super easy. And then don't forget, if you wanna expand this, you just pull down the sides and it expands even more. And that's an every basically Papier item. Almost they have very wonderful abilities in it. This bag is so versatile. You then of course have your shoulder strap here. Easy to throw on, crossbody as well, but it is removable so you can just wear it as a clutch if need be. This would be an excellent daytime clutch or anything of the such. I love it and Balenciaga just makes me feel cool. Like I would wear this to, you know, you know when you go to those really cool like weddings that they have like food trucks there and like the bride has like, uh, you know, topless, uh, not topless, oh my gosh, strapless dress, not topless, or maybe, I don't know, and then just tattooed up, like, and wearing those cool glasses, this is what you would wear to that. This is that kind of wedding clutch for the cool people. I don't have any cool friends like that, but if you do, this is the bag to wear to it. And only $798, below $1,000, like, that's insane. This was originally over $1,000 retail, excellent condition. They don't make it anymore either, the Papier collection. So here you go, this is the piece to go for. Beautiful. All right. This piece really technically isn't a clutch, but it's so precious I had to bring it out. This is the Louis Vuitton Demier Ben Etui Okapi in the size PM, which means petite mod model, so the small model. $550 in beautiful Demier of Ben Cody canvas. We love that. You even have a little part here to easily hook onto your belt or anything like that. Great gift for dad for Father's Day coming up. Once again, just email us if you need it quicker. We'll be happy to help you free of charge for that shipping. You then of course get this. I love this. Look at this. If this doesn't scream dad, I don't know what does. It's a necklace. Or it could be a crossbody, but more, it's a necklace. I absolutely love that. So you can fit everything you need in there. It's canvas, AirPods, the keys, anything your dad needs can go right in there and he'll never lose anything. It is so perfect. I love this little piece. By the way, Okapi, I've been trying to find what this was named after. The only thing I know Okapi is an African, uh, basically like a gazelle kind of style. It has like a zebra type like butt basically all I know about the Okapi, but maybe that's what this was inspired by and they thought it was funny to name it this. So here we have the Okapi, $550. It's a great little almost gift for your father. He will never lose anything again. Absolutely love it. it keeps all of his necessities in there. You can also put it on his belt, anywhere he needs to be if he goes golfing, put it on there if he plays tennis, anything. It will be a great piece to have. $550 for this great item. All right, just a couple more items. We're getting there. Don't you worry, everyone. Thanks for holding in tight for us. Here we have this Fendi. So precious. Fendi Brown Zucchino Croissant Bag. I just love saying croissant that way. In the size mini, I can't get over it. $950. Zucchino basically is the smaller version of the FF print. Zucca is the larger version. This is the croissant mini bag because it looks like a croissant. I had a croissant this morning actually because I knew this was in the show and I wanted to say that. So delicious. I love it because this is not, this is not just the most perfect bag. Perfect little bag. I love when you go to a wedding, a gala, anything like that. Someone has on a sheet dress and then the most micro bag, just like Lizzo did. I have a friend, she lives in Vancouver, Canada. Her name's Jordan and she collects these mini bags. She absolutely loves them. And we may not go a couple weeks without talking, but next thing I know I get a group text and it's just a mini bag. We love it. $950 for this amazing cute little piece. And I love it because you can take off this. It's in that pewter ruthenium hardware, ruthenium. 
it comes from basically the periodic table of elements. That is where they get that color from. That material ruthenium looks like this. So I love that. Instead of a silver hardware, it's more of a darker pewter look. Have that Fendi zipper here. Beautiful. We have the tag in there, so it's just a little. I'm gonna push that down. There we go. If you ever have anything in your bag and it's a little hard for the zipper, just push down the item in it and lift up the zipper just slightly, not enough to pull it off, but that's the best way so you don't get anything crammed up in the zipper. To remove things from the zipper is a nightmare. But there we go. Beautiful piece. Look at that. I mean, is it even worth showing you the interior? There's no wear to it. I don't know if you can even see the interior, but this is such a great little piece. And at the end of the night, if you're like, okay, wait, I'm having too much fun, easily can clip it onto your belt or anything as such so you can have fun and don't worry about the bag. You can probably fit an AirPod, some glitter, and a lip balm in there, and that's all you need. And your cards will fit in there too, but nah. The other people can pay. <laughs> $950 for this cute, cute item. I just love this. So absolutely precious. All right. Getting into our final item for today. We're gonna end with an incredible Gucci item. This is the Gucci Black Leather Web Raja Shoulder Bag in the size mini. I love this piece, look at this. It is a great, almost clutch style. Beautiful, you have that webbing which was inspired by English horse riding. It's called a web when they put that belt underneath the horse's belly to attach the saddle to and make sure it stays on there. And it was traditionally the green and red stripe, which is where Gucci took that inspiration from, along with their horse bits on the loafers you see and on bags. This bag here, I love it, the Raja. Basically, the tiger here is now the defining detail on the Raja line bag, which is this. And it takes its name Raja from the Sanskrit word meaning prince or king. So this is a bag for our princes and kings and queens and princesses out there and everything else, anything else you want to be called. But not for the lords and the ladies. Mm -mm. You have to be a prince or a princess if you want these. We'll take dukes too. But I love it. It's all crystalled and embellished that you can see here. So that roaring tiger head, it was handcrafted with, you know, basically crystals and enamel details and basically accented as well with all these beautiful luxurious stones and it was inspired by basically a brooch creator from fashion jewelry yeah she was in fashion jewelry her name was hattie carnegie she changed her last name carnegie because it was something else but when she came to america she goes what name do i know at the time andrew carnegie was the richest man so she put her last name as carnegie no relation but she was a fashion jewelry designer in the 1940s and this was inspired from that so that's where alessandro michelle took that inspiration and put on this amazing piece you have this beautiful shiny black calf leather, almost like a little distressed in there, which I love, magnetic closure. And then of course, you can always take this chain off and just wear it as the clutch. I love this little mini. It just gives a little bit of gooch. It's almost like an if you know, you know. Like that stripe is noteworthy, but if someone sees that tiger, they know you're like, oh, that's Alessandro Michel era. And then I love, you have the chain. I love that's a full chain rather than any leather within there because that will perfectly work out as a shoulder bag, as a crossbody, or anything of the such. Beautiful piece. I absolutely love this. And look, no wear. There is zero wear to this bag, not even on the interior of the piece. You have that micro suede Alcantara lining, three credit card slots as well. So you do not have to worry about bringing your wallet or anything. An iPhone Max does fit in here, but without its case. That's okay, we can go a night without the case. If you break it, don't come to me. I'm sorry if I gave you that advice. But I am saying it, no liability on me. Your iPhone will be fine. <laughs> so once again, this piece is only $1,450. Absolutely beautiful from Alessandro Michel era. Now that he's no longer with us, this is one of the pieces under his collection. Even if they continue to make it, it's not under him. So this is one of the best pieces you could get. And I love it. I think it's just so classic. It is so smart. Easy to wear it. The nice part is that leather is treated so it has a nice coating over it. So you don't have to worry about damage. It will slide right off. You'll be good. 
$450 for this amazing piece. Okay, everyone. So that concludes today's show for Clutches Anytime for our bag brunch. Thank you for tuning in on your Sunday afternoon or Sunday morning if you're out on the, east, on the West Coast. We are so happy to have you all here today. Once again, we are live Saturday through Wednesday here at What Goes Around Comes Around, The Atelier, located in the beautiful New York City neighborhood of Soho. We're at 113 Wooster Street. Come in, visit us. We'd be happy to show you around. If you want to request me, you may just see me, but I'd be happy to come up, show you around the store. We'll find you the perfect item and of course give you that glass of bubbles. We also have our original flagship location at 358 West Broadway, just a few blocks from us here in Soho. We are celebrating our 30th year anniversary for the company and there it's just, it's beyond exciting time for us. Our two co-founders, Seth and Gerard, they founded the business in 1993 and we are just so excited and they're still with us running the company and we're just doing amazing things. I can't wait to show you guys more. And then don't forget our West Coast store. If you are out West Coast, it is Beverly Hills, just off Rodeo Drive. I have to tell you, it's one of the most beautiful stores I have ever seen. I absolutely love it out there. And then of course the weather, everything like that. I mean, I'll never leave New York, but it's still pretty good. I'll give LA a good, they're, they're a close second, close second. But we love our team out there. If you are unable to visit our stores, just follow us on Instagram and on TikTok and just DM us at what goes around NYC. We'll connect you with one of our amazing stylists or send us a message and email us at live shopping at WGACANY.com and we'd be happy to connect you with anyone out there. Once again, I am your host, Mason Howell, and I'm so excited to have you guys here with me today. Don't worry to tune in, don't worry. Yeah, don't worry, I'm not going anywhere, but tune in tomorrow at 1.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for another show of another amazing products. Thank you to everyone on YouTube, Facebook, here with us on What Goes Around Comes Around, and then of course on Amazon. Thank you to all of our new followers today and for coming here on the chat. We're so excited to have you all. I'll see you guys tomorrow and have a great rest of your weekend.